doing something really unique here. Like nobody's really doing this type of art that I'm doing. I call the sacred art of the Ori. Pretty much putting African patterns, Afro mysteries, putting on the map. Talking about our own culture, our own themes, our own. Right. This can move faster and can like has the power to actually change the whole generation. Can actually translate ideas. It depends on how mm -hmm. you want to use it. This power, you just have to, to channel it. Mm -hmm. I mean, and my own grandmother helped me a lot. Single had let me told me about her own, like my Uriki. She would tell me, "Oma jabo de bubu jala jala, oma nito ibo nili, oma nibura oma nipekwe." If I tell you what it means, oma nito ibo nili, somebody that has something that the West does not have. That's what I mean. Now mm -hmm. it all makes sense, right? Like it never made more sense. Mm -hmm. Like when I even yeah. talk about like this Oriki that I just told you know, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. it's crazy that there was one day I just opened my mouth and it came out. I didn't know I even had it in my head. Mm -hmm. Like some things are stored like in your, like she was just kept on repeating those things mm -hmm. over and over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. And every time I just think, I thank God for her because man, Listen to yourself in my story. Mm -hmm. Understand yourself because everybody's mm -hmm. journey is totally different.